What's up, guys? Welcome to Robin's Nest. This is Mary, and I'm Kevin. Um, today we're gonna do a haul video for Christmas, a layaway Christmas. That's what we'll call it, a layaway Christmas. So we no, did. No, so this was Mission Christmas 2016 we'll, completed. We'll figure out the name later, but yes, completed. Um, we um. We were on a mission to do our Christmas shopping early this year. For the boys. It is, mm, we'll call it St. Patrick's Day weekend. Um, March, I think, 19th. March 19th. And Christmas is done for the most part. For the boys. Toys, yeah. For the boys, toys are pretty much knocked out. Unless if we find any more toys, then they'll probably get bought stored and pushed back for birthdays because their birthdays are like february and march so we have very little turnaround time between the holidays and then planning their birthday so any new toys after this we probably will sh push it back for birthdays and it'll just be a lot easier from here on out not only that but we what we noticed is last year last summer we did a layaway for the christmas and we noticed that over the summer, you are able to get all of the sets together. As you guys know, we have five and six-year-olds, so when we buy Ninja Turtles, we have to buy all four Ninja Turtles, and you know... And the bad guys. And the bad guys. And so what we wanted to do this year was really give them more play sets, and then give them all of the figures that go with it. So as soon as we were able to put Lay Away for 2016, we started January. one. We asked. I said, hey, when's the earliest we could do a layaway um, after the holidays? And she said January she 1st. She said January. <laughs> so we were there January, and we were like, do it. So, I mean, it's easier for us, like she said, full sets. Um, they pretty much restock after the holidays anyway, so no one's looking for full sets. You might no, get one that. thing missing here and one thing missing here because they haven't gotten the restock yet or whatever maybe, but we pretty much got what we wanted well not only that but if any of the toys are on sale they put it on layaway for that sale yeah, whatever price. the price is at that current time i think and i think you're allowed one price adjustment i think during the life of your layaway i think if something goes on sale during that course of layaway i think you're allowed one price just don't quote me on that but I, I think it's that, one so. item I, I don't think it's one full thing but i think it's one item that you can adjust we've never tried it just because we always knew we we're like all right this is the budget this is what it is and usually we're like once it's once it's in there and it's being paid for we're never we really we're never it. really on the on the on on the hunt for it again what we worry about the most is make sure you don't buy it again yes at another store <laughs> so we make sure we know what we got we knock it out um this first set we're gonna do is we weren't able to get everything from this set in the layaway, but we were able to piece it Complete from other stores, set, yes. Yeah. Because there was something at the time of layaway, it was missing. Um, well, the store didn't have it. Well, no, the one thing that we really wanted wasn't there, and they're like, oh, we don't know when we're going to get a restock on it. But they're like, oh, I've seen it, I know it's current, but we they just didn't know when they were going to get a restock. Um, I was able to find it um, like a few days later, actually maybe the next day or so, and I found um, that item that the store was missing, I'll go over it again later, and then a different item like the next day from another <laughs> Target. So here we go. This is Toys R Us Layaway um, for the boys. We did two different series, so we're going to cover them in that series aspect. Wow, bringing out the big guns right off the bat. So we, um, obviously this is the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the Imaginex series, Imaginex brand, or ser yeah, series I should say, because it's uh, Fisher-Price Imaginex. So there's the Megazord. We'll do that, and this is obviously this compartment. Without, we can't, we're not going to unbox it, obviously. Um, that's where all the other Rangers go in there. So we didn't buy this last Christmas, right? Over last summer when we did the layaway for Christmas for 2015, we looked at it, we were like, would the boys like it? We weren't really sure. 
And the funny thing was when we went to Virginia to spend Christmas with his dad and we would go out to the stores, the boys would be like, oh, I want it, I want it. And we were like, why didn't we pick it up? Yeah, so now we, we don't did. know why. We did it. Um, the boys kept seeing it. We kept going by it. So, I mean, it's going to be good for us because we'll be able to play and we'll have that nostalgia feel. And it's a good thing for the boys. They think it's new. They think it's the newest, you know, thing. They think it's newer than the Dino Force or whatever the hell the new one is. <laughs> I don't know. And they um, have like, what we we saw it that one time, and it's like ten colors now. Yeah, like, there's there's too many. I don't know, but they like me. they like the old Power Rangers. Mm -hmm. so, good Which parenting good on our part. All right, so the next part is their um, <coughs> their dinosaurs. There's Dino Zords. We're missing one. You got one? What do you mean we're missing one? We're missing. Okay, so he's holding the blue one. Oh, I am missing one. Right? We got the blue, um... Triceratops. Triceratops. Sorry, guys. And we have the yellow. The yellow. Her saber tooth tiger. saber tooth tiger. And we have... We have? We have it. The Black Ranger. Keep talking. Um, he's gonna go look for it. But then we also picked up these just packs, even though they're duplicates, because the car packs come with the people. You figure with two boys that love to play with toys and hide toys and put them everywhere, having these would always be good because you never know when you're going to need extras. Found it. This one is the black and the blue ranger. And then we have a red and yellow ranger. Sorry, oh, okay. sorry, sorry. And then we have the pink and the green ranger. Back. Now, I will say that in this set, there is no pink ranger. What's up with that? All right. So Not cool. This is the one we were missing. Well, we weren't missing it. Well, I we weren't missing it. I didn't it grab just, the bag. Yeah. All right, so it's the Black Ranger Zax Mastodon. Now, I think they all come together, right? That's what we kind of saw from the back. Like, they all kind of... Something like that. They do something. We'll find I out. I think it was that... I think it's that morphing stage where they kind of go into... I don't know. We'll figure it out. But you see on there, you see the, the red uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex... Um, I found that. That's the one figure that I was telling you about that I found a couple days later at Target. And then I found the other one, which <laughs> I didn't even know existed. The white. The white ranger's Tiger Zord. So, which was weird that they skipped green. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. They skipped, they skipped green, green altogether. And there was no pink. And there was no, and there was no pink. So, that was kind of odd, but yeah. And then, of course, you have to have... The putties. The putties. Need putties. The, black, the bad guys. Bad, bad guys. guys. And of course. Oh, oh. You're not gonna know. Oh, sorry. Goldar. Goldar. Yeah. Giant Goldar with Rita in the back. 10,000 years! <laughs> yeah, it was a little manlier than what she would say, but. Yeah. I almost thought you were gonna do Genie there from Aladdin. Ten thousand years will give you a crick in the neck. Oh no! <laughs> That's kind of what his voice made it sound. Like. Oh, my bad. Anyways, not good at impersonations, but these so that's our Power Rangers. Yep. So did you go over these already? I did. Yeah, I showed them. So yeah, Power Rangers. We'll get these out of the way, and we'll roll. We're not gonna go with the big guns right off the bat for this set. <laughs> <laughs> she just brought it out, ba bam! <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go. This is um, the DC. Again, it's still Imagine X. It's still the Fisher Price Imagine X. Um, so it's gonna be like DC. I think what is it? the DC Super Friends, DC Super Friends, and DC Gotham City sets. I will say I really like the Imagine X. Um, we originally got them with the Avengers, like, people, um, what was it, like, uh, when they were younger, like, it wasn't the, it was, like, the small cars, and it was, like, the, 
The Avengers, like, um... It wasn't Avengers, though. Avengers doesn't make this. They're not Imagine X. That's way school. Are you sure? I'm sure. So, what was the first Imagine X set that we bought? I don't remember. Hmm. I'm gonna have to look that up. Jake? This is Jake and Never Like My Hearts. I don't know. Anyways. So, yeah. Imagine X. DC. As you saw, also Power Rangers. But DC, compared to what... Um, Play School does with Avengers. Imaginex does really good play sets. Really good play sets, especially for our age group, Maybe for the boys. Maybe it's because they look the same. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty much the same. Um, so, we're doing DC, Super Friends, and the Gotham City series. So, we're going to start off with Bane and his um, Bane battle sled. See that right there? All right, and then we're going to have the penguin with his launcher. So obviously we're going to start with the bad guys. Oh, not bad guys. Um, <laughs> that's the Batmobile with... I can't read backwards. Sorry. With lights and Red Robin. Red Batman. Robin. Yum. <laughs> Sorry. All right, and then we're going to have... Then we bought... Um, these two, Wonder Woman and Superman. Just, I'm always like out of the picture. <laughs> um, we got these two because they're not in the main set that you're going to see. But obviously they do play a part in this universe. Now what we noticed with the DC is that like Target has its own exclusives that Toys R Us doesn't have. So, and it's the bad guys, some of the bad guys. So we have to go back yeah, to... Yeah, it's like Croc. Like Spell and Croc, and there's some other ones. So, Poison Ivy, Poison Scarecrow. Ivy. Um, yeah, it's like a whole bad guys. It's like, it's pretty much like this, or like what we saw with the putty set, but it's like, it's like a five, seven, five or seven bad guys. That's all up in there. So that will be bought before Christmas. We have plenty of time. I know we said complete, but. But, um, you couldn't put it on Layaway because it was with Target. Yeah. So, the Joker's Laugh Factory. So, um, I don't know if you guys are into Lego, but this is very similar. This is like the playset version of Jokerland. If you haven't done Lego sets on our channel, we have we'll not. Cover we're that. gonna have to. We'll eventually cover that. We're trying to do more of the stuff that we're doing currently, obviously, and then we'll backtrack on some of our sets that we want to cover. Or stuff that we've had in the past. Um, eventually, obviously. But, yeah. Try to keep it current so we can get So what stuff, he's trying to say is that one of the reasons why we bought this is because it was so nostalgic to our first Lego it was actually, scene yeah, setting yeah, first set, that we right? bought. It's like our first set that we really it, bought. It was our first scene setting. So, um, it came Good with set. like... Good set. It, it really was. Like um ten minifigures. Something like that. 10 or 12. You guys should look it up. With Lego. If you like Lego. It's really good. And DC. It's really good. It covers like a lot. It covers like a Batman Robin. Penguin. Penguin. Joker. Beast Boy. Beast Boy. Poison Harley Ivy. Quinn, Starfire. A whole, whole bunch of them. Go look it up. Alright. And then this is their... <sighs> I don't even know if we can get this all in here. This is That's the what Gotham. She said. Whoa! <laughs> this is, I think, what is it called? Gotham City Center? Can you read that? It is the Gotham City the Gotham Center. Gotham City Center. You see that there? And there's Detective Gordon. And there's the, the people in here the people. Freeze, Riddler, Catwoman, Batman. Suit. But this is going to be obviously this is the main playset um, the boys will be able to have. Sorry. And so yeah, let's see. Like I said, um, on the opposite end, like Avengers, you don't. If you guys have kids and you at this age group, um, Avengers don't seem to have these playsets. And I don't know if it's because um, if it's the differences 
in in licensing or if it's just because there is no main area where Avengers and stuff fight. Not fight, like, but like, yeah, where they where it takes place. Like everyone knows Batman is in Gotham City. So that's predominantly where all of Batman's stuff takes place. And they seem to start revolving all the stuff around that. And Marvel doesn't seem to have that main hub of activity. Well, I think with the Legos, they started because they started now with Stark Tower. Or, like, it's not now, but... Yeah, mm -hmm. they have... It's, everything, obviously, is, like, Stark Tower. And, like, they have it, but they're not as expansive as DC stuff. As far as, like, scene setting. And I think it might be because of that everything in Batman pretty much... Everything in Batman is Gotham City. Right. So they're able to just take that feel And if of you Gotham guys City. haven't watched Gotham, you need to watch it. It's so good. You get paid for that? No. We should have. Licensing people. 30 cents something. Anyways. Yes, Gotham is a good show. Um, I didn't think I was going to like it. I kept telling him I wanted to watch it. I kept telling him... I had to find free time. There's a whole lot of stuff we Somewhere. Watch. Anyways, but I told him that I wanted to watch it and... I don't know, I just picked it up one day and... Good show. Very surprising, so... So, that is the toy haul. Christmas Christmas vision. in February, March. 2016. 2016... So basically, for you parents out there, don't wait till Black Friday. Don't wait till all of the seasonal no. sales. Don't get elbow dropped in the face because of Black Friday. Don't. They don't have the stock to do all of them because what I really hate is like, okay, don't be so fooled. don't be fooled just because they don't the advertise. Yellow. Hold on, don't be fooled just because they don't advertise layaway doesn't mean they won't do it. Um, I know some of the smaller ones probably won't they because they'll they'll give you some excuse. But there's Just, two yeah, right in our it, area that we yeah, did it. Both of them. Because that's the thing. We did these two layaways two different days. We went one to... We went to a totally different one close to my school for the Power Rangers. They had everything of Power Rangers, nothing of DC. So we went ahead and we did layaway there. And then we went to the one closer to the house. And the next one night, and they had all of the stuff for DC restocked. And we did it right there. No issues, no problems. Yeah, so both of our stores, so, so I don't know why your stores would tell you no. Um, like I said, it's just, if you can find everything that you're ideally looking for, for birthday, for Christmas, whatever it may be, and it's not just big items, like in Walmart, well, they'll do it over the holidays or whatever, and they say, oh, just big items. No, you can put it on pretty much at any time. We're able to go in there and just walk up in there and tell them. And even if you already have one layaway, you can do a whole nother layaway. Don't feel like you have to finish one to start another one. As long as you can afford it, obviously. Right. That's the big key. Mm -hmm. Make sure you budget. Just because you got it on layaway, you still got to budget out that you make sure you can still do it. Because they divide it up into three months. I think and it's three months. There... You get three months, four, four payments. Because you have to do the initial payment, and then you have to throw four or five payments. Mm -hmm. one of them. We just know that we did it, knocked it out. Not for nothing, I did it. Is You can make one payment a month, but what I did was I broke it down into every time I got paid, I just paid to Whatever it. amount. So, so this is really not that difficult. Really not. Just go in there like you're going to really pay or like you are like you would normally pay and just tell them, look, I need to do layaway. And but it's a good peace of mind to know that we have everything for them. If, heaven forbid, we fall on hard financial times at the end of the year, at least for their it's, Christmas, it's, it's set. And as parents... Sometimes money gets strapped at the holidays. You know, you're trying to do vacation or whatever it is. And you got put. You still got to put especially holiday meals on the table. Or, Everything you know, else, you just if, gotta, It just happens. Stuff just happens, so... If Kevin wants to start collecting pops, just right on Black Friday. Black Friday. Never a good time He went to from, like, zero pops to, like, 14, 15 pops over Black Friday. Just Black Friday. BB-8, I hate you. Not really. <laughs> that was the one that started it. Well, because Target had the... Oh, and the guy at Target, that the manager that made the dude look for BB-8, thank you. You're, you're the like, real MVP. In the middle of Black Friday, sent the guy to the back He had 45 minutes left on his shift. And she's like, go get that thing, whatever he wanted, <laughs> and restock the rest that's in that case. 
And then we went back and grabbed from whatever he restocked. So, so. thank you, Target Sawgrass. Shout out. <laughs> Did they pay you to that say that? Thirty cents. Thirty cents. I'll take it. Anyway, so that is Christmas done for the boys. All right. Hopefully, if you guys they, have any hopefully questions. they don't sneak onto our YouTube channel and watch this. Boys, turn okay, it off. Okay, we have a, quite a few videos to post. So, so. all right, guys. Bye.